Hey, that's what I'm talking about. That is pretty, dude. Holy cow. What's up, guys? My name is Berkeley. For those who are new, it is too cold to go find snakes, unfortunately. I know, I know, I know. Believe me, I know. Just because snakes can't be found doesn't mean we can't find other cool stuff. So we're headed out to go find some wicked awesome smoking salamanders. Fingers crossed. I've been wanting to find one of these guys for a really long time. Salamanders, why do you do this to me? What a perfect evening for a stroll. Now the hardest part when you're looking for a species you haven't seen before is you have to find habitat on the maps and determine what's gonna be the best area for you to search it. And sometimes this takes a while. So I am driving down this road, cutting through habitat and waiting for a salamander to cross the road. But if it doesn't turn out, then I'll head a little bit further northeast from here where the radar showed that it got more rain. Part of the fun of looking for animals like I do is looking for the ones you don't already know how to find. It is cold and wet, that's for sure. The first location failed, so now we're headed to plan B. All right. Okay, the search for salamanders continues. I'm headed to a new area northeast of where I just was. I was looking at the radar. Looks like the rain hit better over there. So we're gonna see if we have any better luck. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Oh man, that is pretty, dude. Holy cow. All right, guys, but check that out. Oh, there's a car coming. I gotta grab the little fella. Oh. He would have been totally plastered there. Oh, he's cold. I'm cold. <laughs> that is awesome. That is a tiger salamander right there. It's a small skinny one, but it's oh. still cool. It's cold too. <laughs> How about that guys? We got a tiger salamander. I'm just pulling off to the side of the road literally just a few feet. I don't want to take this guy too far. And we're going to take a better look at this awesome looking salamander. Woo! Woo! Oh! You better do it fast. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. It's a skinny little dude, but he was uh, crossing the road. And like I said, the weather wasn't perfect. So regardless, I'm very grateful that this little guy showed up. We're not gonna spend a lot of time with them, as very cold. Um, taking pictures is always... Yikes, is it's icy cold. <laughs> I'm so cold. Holy crap. Oh man, I'm cold. It's gotta pretend like I'm not cold. Oh, my hands are numb. Oh, I'm cold. So yeah, these guys, as you can tell, move in the winter months when it's cold and very uncomfortable. These spots are very cool on these guys. I actually found one not too long ago in the previous video that wasn't nearly as pretty as this and he was moving during the day. So these guys can get big enough to where they'll actually eat small rodents, but these guys will eat a lot of insects of various kinds. Right now, the reason they're crossing roads is because it's actually their breeding season during a recent rain or cold rain or sometimes even after a snow. Not when you would expect it when it's really cold. My fingers are very icy. Ooh. Glad we were able to save this guy from the car. Oh goodness. Thank you. Thank you for that. Oklahoma boy. <laughs> Oklahoma. Don't, don't forget where you are. Yeah, don't forget where you are. Anyway, that's what we saved this little salamander from was surely one of those crazy cars that are zooming around here at night. So we're gonna safely move this guy off the road. Super cool. Tiger salamander. There's a nice little burrow right there. See ya, dude. There he goes. I'm so cold, it's not even funny. I look ridiculous, I feel ridiculous. I'm getting in my car. Holy crap, it's so cold. Last video, I asked you guys to help me, and you did. So I wanted to share the top three people that shared. You guys all shared really awesome stuff, but I wanted to share the top three people. One of you was E Reptile Dysfunction, uh, who shared Audio Slave, which is an artist I've never heard before, music-wise. I like the song Gasoline, I Am A Highway, and Explorers. Um, and then the next person was Leonard Bielan, who shared the Wild Times podcast. Forrest is a really cool guy. I've talked to him over social media before. Excellent, excellent conservationist. He's doing awesome work. So if you haven't checked him out before, definitely go check that out. And then Fire of the Greeks. You shared a different style of music that I'm not used to, a heavier metal style, but I liked hearing something different. And it was very entertaining to be exploring your guys' new stuff. 
Ah, we did it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know that was a really short video, but we went out, we conquered, we found what we were looking for. Now I'm headed back. I'm frozen. Thank you guys so much for watching. Watch previous videos. If you haven't seen our videos before, subscribe. We'll see you next time. Peace out.